Hello, thank you for watching today's Foresight Plus tutorial. Foresight, a cloud-based application, is designed to promote engagement with your reserve study. As a recent Reserve Advisors client, you received a 60-day complimentary trial to Foresight Plus. Foresight Plus provides your team the tools they need to create alternate scenarios. Are you considering deferring or accelerating any particular capital projects? You can create alternate scenarios to see how it would impact your year-end reserve balances. Do you want to prepare an alternate funding plan? Go ahead and create alternate scenarios to see what funding solutions might be feasible for your community association. You can create as many scenarios as you'd like. Let's take a closer look. To create a model, click on the model slash create new scenario button. Here we can begin working with the original study from Reserve Advisors or the 2020 budget model, which I previously created. We now have a model to work with. First, let's begin updating our schedule of capital expenditures. First, we're not going to replace our roof in 2021. We're going to defer until 2022. So we can update that line item by clicking on the magnifying glass, changing our first year replacement to 2022. Foresight will automatically update the schedule of events for that component and will apply inflationary increases and decreases where appropriate. You can also phase and unphase projects in Foresight. For example, in 2022, we anticipate replacing the floor coverings and redoing the paint finishes in the hallways on floors two through 17. We want this project to take place over a period of two years or phase it over a period of two years. So we can simply click the number of phases and change that to two. As you can see here, now we have that project phase over a period of two years. If I change that first year of replacement to 2021, you can see that the schedule of events automatically updates as well. We can do the same thing with the paint finishes. Now let's take a look at a project that was going to occur in 2020. We now have the cost of that project. In particular, it's for our chiller. We can change that 2020 unit cost to what the actual cost was. And again, it'll update the cost for 2020 as well as the anticipated cost in 2050. I now want to evaluate the merits of adjusting my annual reserve contributions. It's important to note that we have a critical year in 2024. Critical year is identified by the point in time in which your reserve study balance is at its lowest point. Any change that we make to the schedule of anticipated expenditures and or reserve contributions is gonna have the largest impact on that critical year. So let's get started with utilizing our funding calculator. In this instance, this association has a stepped increase in reserve contributions in the amount of $116,000 per year for a period of three years, followed by inflation. We can see that beginning in 2022, the annual increase is $116,000, and beginning in 2025, we have inflationary increases to contributions. The fixed value in any year allows a user to, to identify a uh, one-time increase to reserve contributions, followed by the inflationary adjustments. For example, if I wanted to change my 2021 reserve contribution to $600,000, Foresight will automatically apply inflationary adjustments to contributions from that point moving forward. I scroll to the bottom of our page, we'll see that our critical year has now shifted to year 2050, and we are anticipating a negative reserve balance beginning in year 2048. So this is an iterative process where we can make different changes to the funding recommendations to achieve the ultimate level of funding that we desire. I'm now going to reset the funding to the original study. And we're gonna go back to the stepped funding increase. The stepped funding increases, we can identify a set number of years and how much we would like reserve contributions to increase on an annual basis, followed by inflationary adjustments. So for example, instead of having a $116,000 annual increase, we want to experiment with a $100,000 annual increase. We still wanna begin that in year 2022 because we have several large expenditures in the near term. 
But since we're contributing less or our increase is less on an annual basis, I'm going to extend the number of years from three to four. And we'll see that my threshold year is still in 2024. And my balance is 327,000 instead of 425. I want to apply this change, I can go ahead and hit save. Now I have my updated funding plan. When we're finished with our model, we want to publish it to our account for other users to access. Simply close the model, save your changes, and you can apply a name. After saving, the model is published to your Foresight account. To access your model in the future, click on Model, Create New Scenario, and you can open up that model. Thank you for watching today's tutorial.